hi everyone welcome to my youtube channel so in this video we're going to i'm going to teach you how you're able to install jupyter notebook so jupyter notebook is where you could write your python codes in so it's an it, it's a good alternative to vs code or your pycharm so with jupyter notebook it's another alternative another environment in which you can write your python codes in so the first thing we're going to do here is that we're going to just type in mkdir so we want to type in the name of the folder we um, want our um, python codes to be in so just type in mkdir then the name of the folder so let's just say um let's just say practice page let's say practice page uh let's see let's see practice page yeah practice page so and I'll do CD CD practice practice page yeah so the next thing I'm going to do now is I'm going to create a virtual environment now I've created the project I've created the folder now I want to create a virtual environment where I'll be putting this you know these Jupyter notebooks in so I'll just create a virtual environment in so I'll do, the, how I'll create it is I'll just type in Python minus M then this stands for virtual environment then this can be anything this can be anything uh this can be anything so i'll just type in practice page projects practice page project so it could be anything so this is the virtual environment i'm creating so um so you can see this virtual and nv environment virtual environment so let's click on enter so it's preparing the virtual environment you know, so it's loading it's loading loading it's loading it's loading by the way please make sure you you have internet access make sure you have internet access very very important very 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 important make sure you have internet access because you are going to be installing things to set up our jupyter notebook so next thing we're going to do is that we are going to now do cd practice cd practice page practice page projects yeah cd practice page project yeah so that's so cd into the virtual environment you get the point yeah so click on enter and now i'm going to do cd scripts capital letter c cd scripts and i'm going to do dot slash activate so what do, what this does is that it's going to activate the virtual environment that's the practice page project so by the time i click enter it's going to you you are going to see something like a bracket in here so just the dot slash activates so like i said make sure you have internet access make sure your internet access is very very strong it's going to be very important if you want to install jupyter notebook right from the terminal so dot slash activates so as you can see like i said practice page projects the virtual environment has already been created so it's already there so the next thing i'm going to do now is that when i'm going to install libraries i mean the jupyter notebook is virtually almost set if not even already set so we just need to install libraries and the first library we're going to install is this um numpy numpy so pip install numpy so this will install this library in python for us pip install numpy and just click on enter like i said make sure your internet access is you have very good internet access if not this library will not install so please 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 civil player make sure your internet access is very strong so as you can see now it's successfully installed now if i want to install another library per adventure i want to start another library i'll just do pip install pandas pandas is another library to install so i'll just do pip install pandas and i'll just click enter so it's loading it's loading it's loading as you can see make sure you have internet access so please make sure you have internet access so that you see um make sure your internet access is strong make sure it's strong strong it has to be strong 
strong. So it's still loading, it's still loading, it's still loading. Um, still installing, still. So let me just use this as an opportunity. So just, you know, this thing is just practice, practice. No, we've already done. Just practice, practice. With time, you get comfortable with it. So the next thing I'm going to do is we're going to now install the main one. Pip install Jupyter, Jupyter Notes book. So it's loading, it's loading, Jupyter Notebook coming up, coming, 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 coming. It's loading. Woohoo! Jupyter Notebook, our environment. Where we write our Python codes. Jupyter Notebook. By the way, before you can do this, make sure you have um, Python installed in your computer. Make sure you have Python installed in your computer. So you can do this. Uh, it's loading. It's, it's loading, 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 loading. The Jupiter is loading. So just play with this thing, play with this terminal, just practice, practice, practice. Trust me, it's frightening. Trust me, up to now it still gives me some shakes, but you know. The more you practice, the more you practice, the more you build that confidence and you know you are up and up and going. So it's just have to give your time to practice. Practice using this terminal. You have to face your fears because this terminal gave me a lot of fears and the only way I can fight it is to face my fears. So I, I had to face my fears by practicing this using the terminal instead of going through the GUI. You know, just use the terminal. You know, with time, you get comfortable with it. It's not a one day, you know, daily, daily using the terminal. You build confidence and you will be very alright. So our our Jupyter notebook is is almost set. So we just type in Jupyter notebook now. Um, Jupyter. Notebook. So it's coming up very soon. It's coming up. Ooh, ooh, we have our Jupyter Notebook. So that's it, guys. So you, we, we, we have successfully installed the Jupyter Notebook. We have successfully installed the Jupyter Notebook. So that's simply how to install the Jupyter Notebook. So you can see here the Jupyter Notebook environment. Uh, so if you want to still want to um, you want to see where you write your Python codes in you just go to this new click on Python 3 then so there we have it this is Jupyter as you can see so as you can see it's Jupyter so this is how this is where we write our you know, Python codes in so thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you've not subscribed to my channel, please remember to subscribe to my channel so you will not miss any of my amazing videos. Thank you so, so, so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.